It's a night of sports and glitz, but really, it's all about the kids. This is why you're donating. This is why we do what we do. This is why you're here. And so the kids are just a big part of the fundraising. The Dick Vitale Gala raises millions every year for pediatric cancer research, something 14-year-old Ethan McNary says doesn't get the funding it needs to find a cure. Like four cents a dollar, that's crazy. I didn't even know that until today, tonight. And it's just like raising money for this, it just means so much to me because like I don't want other kids to have to go through this. Cole Iger says he was in shock when he was diagnosed with cancer in 2014. Because I was a really healthy kid, I was playing soccer, you know, I was a regular teen, just having fun, and it just boom hit me. Now he's in remission raising money to help other kids fight. I can say that I'm back playing soccer, um, back to school, um, back to everything that I was back to, and I, I'm enjoying life. Vital raised $3.12 million Friday night, but his work isn't over after the gala ends. He works tirelessly year-round with these kids, making their cancer journey a little easier. He's like been really inspiring to me, like how passionate he is towards these things and um, in my mind he's like my best friend. So. It's Tony Colton's second gala. He says the years he was too sick to come, Vital still made sure he was honored. He remembers the kids very personally and just to be at an event held by a guy like that is incredible. Reporting from the Ritz Carlton in Sarasota, Lyndon Blake, SNN, the Suncoast News Network.